What is up, fellow travelers? Sam here from The Traveling Medics, and I want to make a video to talk about some of the cruise news that's been going on in the past couple of days. Uh, one of the biggest stories that's been making headlines in the cruising industry and throughout the travel industry is that the CDC has finally lifted its COVID advisory for cruises. Uh, you may recall that it has been a level four for most of the pandemic, and then a little while back they dropped it down to a three, and just a couple of weeks ago dropped it down to a level two. Uh, they have completely lifted their advisory altogether now. What does that mean? Still some questions out there. Does it mean that pre-boarding testing may go away? Does it mean the vaccine requirements may go away? All of that is still up in the air. No one really knows yet, but they have said it is safe to travel. So if you were worried about traveling, if you were worried about cruising, uh, hopefully that'll help ease you uh, and, and get you excited about cruising again. For those of us who have been on cruises uh, through all this, we know that cruising has been safe. Uh, we've been on two cruises ourselves since November. Uh, extremely safe, extremely fun. Uh, hopefully you'll be cruising again soon. Uh, our second story is uh, coming from Princess Cruises. And they have announced that on six vessels that are sailing to Alaska, Princess claims to be the, the, the number one Alaskan cruise line. And on six of their vessels, they are doing what they're calling a it's called North to Alaska program. Uh, this is a culinary program where they're going to use more locally sourced uh, food. Uh, some of the fish they're going to use. They're going to have things from cod to sockeye to salmon, some other things. It's a specialty menu made just for these cruises. Uh, they also are going to source, uh, they're going to have cocktails with local source spirits from some of the, the distilleries in the area. It's all to just kind of ramp up and get people to experience uh, more local food than cuisine. Uh, and Princess uh, does a great job with their food. They're probably one of the best in the industry when it comes to the food on board. So this is something that, especially if you are already a Princess fan, you probably should be pretty excited about. Uh, and then finally, Disney Wish, one of the most uh, talked about cruises, one of the most looked forward to cruise ships, I should say, uh, has made its way out of the shipyard. It's doing its sea trials. It's... Uh, doing its con conveyance down the river, and it should be set to sail here this summer. Uh, again, many fans of Disney out there, many fans of Disney Cruise Line, even with the higher prices of Disney Cruise Lines. So if, if that's something you're looking forward to, it's good to see it come out of, the, out of the shipyard. It's just one of many ships that are coming out in 2022 that we're super excited about. So that's what we want to talk about today, and until next time, keep traveling.